Hey Gemini gang, what's happening? It is officially cancer season. So shout out to the cancers. Um, yeah, y'all. And it's summertime. So it's officially summertime. So let's see what's going on at Gemini's. Springtime is through. <sighs> All right, y'all. Let's see what's happening. Happy Thursday. All Gemini placements, take what resonates, leave the rest, take it how it resonates in your situation. Personal readings are in the description box. On the website, hit those likes, hit those subscribes. <laughs> Y'all know the drill. So some of you may be separated from someone. We have separation here on the bottom of the deck, which I find interesting because reconciliation was the first card out. So this could be the one. Mm -hmm. And the chemistry, all right? So let's see what's going on. Gemini's. Okay, seven of wands. Mm -hmm. Someone not ready to give up or wanting to give you up. Could be a Leo for some of you. Mm -hmm. Heavy Leo. Nine of wands, more not giving up energy. Could be an Aries. A lot of fire, 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 fire. And see, you see that magician, magician tried to peek his head out there. And he has that infinity symbol over his head like the strength card does. So I feel like Gemini's. Um, someone's not wanting to give up. This could be someone that you may have separated from. Uh, take it how it resonates. But this is someone is, that's not ready to give up uh, yet, Gemini's. Or, or doesn't want you to give up. cancer season and then the queen of cups comes out so <laughs> that's crazy so some of you could be dealing with a cancer or this could it signify you take it how it resonates gemini's but i feel like someone is feeling uh someone's in their feelings that's what i'm getting when i see this queen of cups someone is in their feelings gemini's so especially if you are separated from this person, it's like they may be thinking about you, wondering about you, wondering what you're doing. Um, Gemini is wanting to talk to you, wanting to be uh, open or they want this from you, Gemini. It's possible that, that they want you to be more emotionally open and uh, emotionally available uh, for them again. Take it how it resonates. Oh, yikes. Uh, the three of swords. Yeah, y'all are separated in the ace of pentacles with the four on the bottom. There is a separation here. Mm hmm. Yeah, Gemini's. Um, but someone doesn't want to be separated anymore. Yeah. Some of you may have taken your mind off of this situation or this, this situation with this person to focus on other things. But yeah, there is definitely a separation here. Um, for some of you, this could have already happened. Uh, and this person is um, not wanting you to give up on them, Gemini's. This is what I'm getting. Someone doesn't want you to give up on them. Uh, they may be having like a hard time as well. Like they may be going through some things, which I pick up for you guys a lot. Um, because I'm, I'm envisioning like a situation where you're trying to like break things off with a person and um, they're like, no, like, no, I, I don't want to separate. I don't want to, I don't need a break or whatever. Because you might be like, we need a break or whatever. And they're like, no, I actually, I don't want that. I, I'm, I'm good. Like, you know, just give me some time, you know, don't give up type of situation, uh, Gemini's. Yeah. Nine of Pentacles, mm -hmm. five of Pentacles on the bottom. Yeah, there could be this person going through some things. They could be trying to build themselves up, build themselves out of a situation. Um, as far as financial wise, something could be going on with a house too. Like this person may be like trying to buy a house or something's going on with their house. 
this person may have people living with them as well. Like they may have family members living with them or whatever that they want out. <laughs> I don't know why I got that, but yeah, Gemini's. I feel like this person just has um, a lot of obligations that a lot of people like depending on them, if that makes sense. Um, yeah. Nine of Cups, yes. Lots of nines. Some of you may be seeing nine, 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 because we're seeing triple nine here. So nines are usually about uh, independence, um, but they're they're also like that step right below the ten, right before you get to the ten. So I feel like a, I feel like an energy of like an almost there, like Gemini, like hold on, like I'm almost there, I'm almost ready, like don't give up yet type of situation um Gemini's that's the vibe I'm getting so this person may be like trying to get stuff together get stuff in line or whatever like I said some of them may have people like depending on them like family friends whatever like legit living with them for some of you um and they're trying to get them out Gemini's but I, I feel like they are like wanting you to like hold on hold off on moving on or whatever the case may be hold off on this break because i feel like some of you guys ask for a break especially if this person uh you may feel like this person's too busy for you this is similar energy that i got yesterday this person's too busy for you or they have a whole lot going on you may have been like okay well we can just get some space then since since you need time to yourself so you can get whatever you need to get together and this person's like no like you know we don't we don't need a break type of thing yeah two of wands this is the vibe i'm getting gemini's like this person trying to figure out if um or figure out how to um open up or express anything to you gemini's but i also feel like too whoever this is could be whoever they are like living with now, it doesn't have to be necessarily a, um, it doesn't have to be like another lover, but it could be like a family member. Sometimes the Queen of Cups gives me mom vibes. Yeah, the Empress is on the bottom. Okay, thank you, Spirit. It could be a mother, like this person is taken care of, um, or is like staying with them and won't leave type of thing or can't leave. Yeah. <coughs> It could simply be them too. Yeah, the lovers on the bottom. Them planning how to open up. Them planning how to be more vulnerable with you. Because I feel like this person does want to tell you what's going on in their life. But I feel like they um, they may fear judgment, Gemini. They may feel like you'll judge them or whatever if they like really told you what was really going on with them. Or uh, you know how deep they are in the mess that they're in. So this person could be like in debt or they could have like multiple people living with them um, that is, is uh, financially depending on them in some way, uh, Gemini's. And I feel like you, you may not know the whole thing regarding what's going on with them, um, Gemini's. But I feel like they do want to open up and tell you uh, what's going on. Or why they're, you know, always busy or whatever the case may be. Yeah, see, Ten of Wands. I feel like this person just has a lot on their shoulders, um, Gemini's. But, you know, it, it is their own doing, but they do have this tendency to want to feel responsible for everything and everybody around them, Gemini's. And I feel like it may uh, interfere with you and, and the connection. Could be a Leo some of you are dealing with. I'm seeing the King of Wands here on the bottom. I've seen a lot of Leo energy, a lot of fire energy here. Um, Gemini, Six of Cups on the bottom. <sighs> Lord, Gemini's. <laughs> this makes me wonder if there's someone else in the picture on your end. Mm hmm. I won't dive too deep into it, but. I feel like uh, in the midst of you waiting on this person, you may have met someone else or you started talking to someone else and they, whoever this past person is, is aware of it. Yep. 
they're aware of it or they suspect it, Gemini's. And they're like, mm-mm, nobody taking my Gemini away, child. Five of wands on the bottom, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. They're like, nope, mm-mm. Ain't nobody taking my Gemini. <laughs> I'm hearing that song, Ain't Nobody Taking My Baby by, um, by Russ. Ain't nobody taking my baby. That's that's the vibe I'm getting with this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, lordy, 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 Gemini's. The Justice card. Mm-hmm. The world. Yep. The Page of Pentacles. The Page of Cups, y'all. The King of Cups is on the bottom. There is someone else, Gemini's. You do have somebody else. There is a divine counterpart energy here. See, I told you, I feel like I feel like this Queen of Cups was you, Gemini's. Um, them wanting like some compassion from you or some understanding from you. It doesn't mean you don't give it to them. It's just that this person may not tell you everything that's going on with them, Gemini's. And I feel like that's what they're wanting. But you see, the King of uh, the Queen and the King of Cups is here, so you are dealing with a divine. But there's this King of Wands over here with this Three of Swords. Mm hmm regardless of gender Gemini's there may be someone else here um mm hmm or this person just feels like you uh you do have somebody else um but one of them is a new person is is something new that you have kind of um you've you've gotten into because of this situation with this person and I and I feel like granted this person, the past person doesn't open up. They don't say anything. They don't tell you what's going on. As far as you know, they're not interested because they don't tell you anything. They may go MIA, you know, you know, they don't make time for you and things like that. It's just a vibe that I get. And then, so you just started entertaining someone else. So now it's like, well, damn. <laughs> yeah, so this, that's why I'm getting the vibe of like, don't give up on us. Don't give up on me type of uh, energy Gemini it's like this person wants to bring balance with you um they see you as their everything with the world here there's definitely heavy reconciliation here uh Gemini it's like you're 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 their end all be all like there's there's nothing else but you Gemini that this is the vibe that I'm getting with them yeah but I do feel like this person has to learn to uh needs to learn how to say no um to the people in their lives because it's it's affecting this is so similar to the reading from yesterday if it's, it's affecting the connection with you gemini's this person's inability to tell people no this person's inability to um you know put their own needs and wants first and, and not feel like they have to be responsible for everything and everybody gemini's this person may have children too. Take that how it resonates. Or you have children with them. <clears throat> they may have uh, children or a child, uh, particularly a son, that uh, depends on them a lot too. So I feel like this person just, they, they have a lot of uh, burdens in their lives, Gemini's. And, but I feel like it, it is self-inflicted though. Like this person doesn't know how to say no. Like they... They don't want to, I'm getting a vibe with someone that doesn't want to let anyone down. It doesn't want anyone to be mad at them or whatever the case may be. Well, except for you, Gemini. They're okay with you being mad at them. <laughs> oh, Lordy. All right, let's get a couple of these handwritten. I dream about you. Mm-hmm. Yes. So if you're separated from this person, yeah, that, that won't last long. What'd I tell you? Damn! <laughs> I'm about to call slash text you. I told you that was fast. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's see what's going on. I used them to get over you and it didn't work. Now, I don't know why I feel like Gemini. This could be either you or this person. Because I feel like you may have started talking to someone else in the midst of this person's neglect um, or whatever the case may be. I stay awake for hours thinking about you. Take that how it resonates. You give me butterflies because that may not apply at all. <clears throat> I can feel you detaching from me. I'm telling you. I feel like that, that using this other person to get over this person is you. 
you started talking to someone else um, in between this person's neglect or whatever, whatever it is they have going on, them taking on more burdens than they really need, um, Gemini's. I just wasn't ready for you. Mm hmm. Lots of burdens, lots of responsibilities, uh, Gemini's. I'm seeing things differently now. Mm hmm. I bet. I certainly bet. <laughs> Lifetime by Erica Badu. Ooh, ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Let love in. Mm hmm. Yes. Hurting you only hurt myself. I thought I would never lose you. See, yeah, that's why I feel like some of you guys have, have moved on or are on the, on the verge of it. Um, Gemini's Who Knows by Music Soul Child. Worst I Assume by JoJo. And let me get one more. I don't know how to fix this. Please tell me how. All right, Gemini's. Hit those likes. Thank you for watching. Peace out.